Well, hey everybody, I've been working on this guitar. This is a Tesco body guitar that someone gave me and I painted it and I haven't had a chance to play it yet and I'm hoping it sounds really good, but modding my own guitars is super fun and you can do it too. That's not the point of the video. The point of today's video is that we were supposed to give a guitar strap away. Unfortunately, uh, being new to YouTube, I had no idea that you can't actually see your subscribers. You can't actually see the names of the people who are following you. Uh, at least not that I can figure out. So what I'm gonna need you to do, if you wanna win the guitar strap, let me grab it, where is it? If you wanna win this guitar strap, a brown and gold racer strap, you're gonna need to comment. It's an unfortunate side effect of me not understanding how YouTube works. So go ahead and comment, leave a comment about this video, and um, we're gonna go over your comments. So on our Instagram, I went ahead and did a poll and I asked you guys, to ask us some questions that you have a uh, burning desire to know the answers to. So I'm gonna answer some of the comments. Uh, here we go. First one up is from Poncho Solar. It's, what's the difference between a cheap and expensive strap? This is a great question. A lot of people think that our guitar straps are a little pricey and I can understand. They're not as cheap as let's say an Ernie Ball $5, $10 uh, nylon webbing strap. And the reason is, is because we use really high quality materials when we make ours. And when you get a cheaper strap, let's just say it's a nylon strap, it might, the strap itself, that part might last a lifetime, but the tabs might not last a lifetime. But also there's a lot of other considerations that go into it, like quality of stitching, the manufacturing location. For example, we make everything ourselves here in our shop in America, which I think is pretty important in this day and age, don't you? Hope that answered your question. Next up is Cliff is Boring. Have you ever made a guitar strap out of a couch? The answer is yes, actually, we have. We've had a lot of people send in different materials. I've had somebody send in their dad's necktie, for example. I've had people send in their car seats. I've had them send in the seat belt from their car that they loved into us, and then we make it into a beautiful guitar strap. And I'm very positive we've made several guitar straps out of couches. The thing is, we're not called couch guitar strap because of the upcycled vintage couch materials that we use. We're actually called couch guitar straps because of the guy who started the company. His name's Dan Perkins, and he's my boss, and he, Instead of paying rent one day, he decided to spend his money on a sewing machine. He gave up his apartment and he slept on a couch until his business got off the ground. Our next question is from Alex DePigeon. Any highly coveted materials that would be a dream to upcycle? Yes, there are many things that I would love to upcycle. For example, the outfits that rock stars wear on stage. You know, you see Elton John in like a, in like a peacock feather, rhinestone outfit. I would love to get a celebrity's outfit and upcycle it into like a limited edition. This strap was David Bowie's jumpsuit from 1987. Like how amazing would that be, right? Lars Guitar MN asks, what is the square root of a hypotenuse? Math is not my strong suit. Ask a professional, I don't know. Octavio Mag says, love your straps, but I really dislike the black ends on some of the models. Are there any options? We make end tabs of all colors. Black is just the option that we start off with. If you want to, you can email us at buy at, buy at couchguitarstraps.com. Let's see if I did that right in post. If you want blue, brown, orange, whatever you want, we can make it happen. That's the nature of the custom shop here at Couch Guitar Straps. Alan Leary says, can you customize wallets, purses, etc., in a similar fashion to the straps? Email us at buy at couchguitarstraps.com and you can take one of our tote bags or one of our other bags and request a different fabric to replace the one that we have in stock. It all really depends on what we have in stock at the moment. A lot of our materials are hard to get. They're vintage and they'll never be made again. So if we have it and we have enough of it, um, we will do it for you. And finally, the last question of the day is by On Sunday Shoes. Does everyone at Couch have a particular strap they like the best? And for this, I made a little cut. Let's check it out. My favorite strap that we're doing right now is the Wonderland Heart strap, full of nice, rich detail. He likes the tiger. I like the tiger strap. That's my favorite right now. Dixie Cup Cooler Smash is my favorite strap because <laughs> they're all different. All right, thanks for watching Couch Guitar Strap comments questions, whatever this video is called. I appreciate you. Make sure to comment in the down here area so that uh, you can have a chance to win the guitar strap. I know I was gonna give it away this last week. We got busy with the sale 
I was so swamped. I literally threw my back out making guitar straps last week. Maybe next week, uh, maybe the week after that, depending on how busy we get, I will go ahead and give that strap away. Just for one last little peek at the strap. Here it is, gold and brown Racer X. It matches my Epiphone, that's why we made it. But I have a lot of straps, I don't need this one. You want it? It's yours maybe. All right, like, subscribe, see ya.